It's time! Up next, it's a lightweight bout between Connor, notorious McGregor, and the professional. Who will take for this lightweight collision? The professional is seven years his elder. He is four inches taller. He will have a one inch reach advantage. With the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment U.S. fans around the world have been waiting for. Six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 154 pounds, fighting out of the muscle Cypress, the professional. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 20 wins, three losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Dublin, Ireland. All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Good luck. The wait is finally over. They are going to fight. Conor McGregor, the professional. And here we go. Fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. Black trunks for the professional. White trunks for McGregor. Conor McGregor has a very unpredictable striking style. Throws a lot of wild kicks, has some excellent knockout power in his punches, and has a very strong ground game as well. He caught the kick. Oh, nice wow. body kick. He defends the head strike with a strong parry. Nice body kick. Wow, what a great job mixing things up. The professional with a good jab. He blocks that shot to the body. Oh, nice. Swinging early, both men. Very good exchanges here. See if they can keep up this pace, Joe. He connects with the straight. Good leg kick by the professional. Man, beautiful front kick. And he misses. The professional with the lead hook. Now he's got him in the plum clinch. Joe, nice foot stomp by McGregor. Good knee. He moves to the Muay Thai clinch. Tying up here in the clinch, working to get an advantage. Now he's got over under. McGregor with a hook from the clinch. Just over three now. Oh, we got tagged. And he's got his back. And separate. Big head kick lands. Big yeah. shots! There's a nice combination. There he is! He got the takedown. Oh. 
The professional with a nice punch from the bottom. Great transitions on the ground. Back to full guard, yeah. very nice. He gets his back. He's got full mount here. And he postures up. That's a big elbow, Joe. Huge elbow. Great transition to top position. Very nice sweep. He's attacking with the rear naked choke. He's free from the rear naked choke. Wow, look at that. How good is that? Uh oh. He has a huge elbow to the head. Face now, he's posturing up. The professional with the strong elbow to the body. Man, he's got the reversal. Oh, looking for his back. Thirty seconds now. That connected. Twenty seconds. He scores with punch. a huge left. That's a hard hammer fist. Oh, he caught a rear naked choke. He escapes with a rear naked choke. That'll do it for round one. Here's a perfect kick to the body. Here's a nasty kick to the body. Here's a powerful head kick that lands. Incredible highlights in that round. All right, listen. I need you to go out there and I want you to do more of that. Let's set up those takedowns with your strike, and let's work for your single leg, double leg, transit. Brittany gets us set for round number two. Switching his stance up a little bit. Good right hook to the body by McGregor. He's doing a great job of timing these shots. McGregor with another shot to the body. A big spin and a miss. Nice spinning back kick. He landed that, Mike. Good roundhouse kick to the midsection. The professional with a nice punch. Knee to the body here. Once again, he changes his stance. Nice. The professional's got the reach advantage in this game, but he hasn't used it effectively. He definitely could be doing a far better job of utilizing his natural reach advantage and doing a far better job of placing himself out of the shots. from the clinch. Tying up here in the clinch, looking for openings. 
And they move out of the clinch. That's a nice right-left combo by McGregor. Hard kick to the body by McGregor. Head kick. Hard straight punch. Just over three now. Let's see what he can do from here. Hip escape. Gets out of the full mount. In full guard here. Nice body shot from the bottom by the professional. Tags him. Back to half guard now. The swelling on his eyes is starting to get really bad. The professional gets it back into his guard. And he connects with the punch. He's just gonna step right back over. Hip escape. And he's out of the full mount. Nicely done. Caught him with the right. He's now working for full guard. McGregor's in half guard again. Full guard here. The professional with a punch that connects. That's a vicious elbow. He's working from his back now. Full mount. Side control. Nicely done. Found a home for that. He works his way into north-south. And right back to side control. Half guard here. And there's a reversal. Shot from the bottom. Back to full guard. He passes again into half guard. Into full guard here. Trying to take the back here. Inside the guard again. He's got him in his guard. Nice shot. That's a big elbow. Tries to move to half guard, but can't. 15 seconds. Hammer fist by McGregor. Joe, that cut keeps getting worse, and it looks nasty. And again, he's got half guard. Round oh, no. two in the books. Joe, that cut is looking worse. The professional's bleeding from his nose. That's a nasty thing to happen because when your nose is bleeding like that, you start opening up your mouth, and that leaves you susceptible to getting knocked out. And here's another punch that sneaks through. And here's another perfectly placed punch. Hey, cut man, cut man! The beautiful Carly. Round number go. three underway. Man, he goes down. The professional with the elbow to the head. Nice sweep to get to top position. Oh, he gets reversed and mounted. Man, he gave up his back. Not good. Half guard. Side control. Nicely done. Wow, quick movement on the ground. Side control. Nicely done. 
He's back in the full guard now. Great work from the bottom by McGregor. Joe, they get up. Nice shot. Both men throwing frequently. Both of his eyes are looking pretty swollen now. The professional with a kick to the midsection. He switches the stance. That's a hard inside leg kick. Oh, he got tagged there. Oh, there beautiful you go. combination. Joe, everyone in attendance tonight might actually be Irish. Listen to the support for Conor McGregor. Doing an excellent job of mixing up his strikes here. He lands a head kick. Body kick, look at that. Back and forth battle. Oh, very nice. McGregor gets side control. Half guard. Now he's in guard. McGregor gets side control. Great movement on the ground. He scores with a huge shot with the left. Oh, big shot from the top. He has the huge hand. left. He's got both hooks in. Joe, this is dangerous. He's got him flattened out. He's got him flattened out here. He's got the full mount, Joe. He's posturing up here. Now he's going for an arm bar here. He pulled his arm out of it. Oh, oh nice big right, right hand. hand. Huge elbow. elbow lands to the head. Oh, some heavy shots from the top. Oh, oh, big right hand clipped him. Huge wow, that's left a big hand. left hand. That's it. That's it. And it is all over. Tremendous TKO. Great stoppage by the referee. Time now for our fight replay. Let's take one more look at the end of the fight here. This is a vicious series of strikes, ground and pound, that lead up to the TKO. We can see it here on a different angle. There are some big shots getting through here. Vicious ground and pound combination that leads to the TKO. And let's take a look at that from a different camera. With the official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop in this contest at 3 minutes, 31 seconds of the third round. He played the winner by TKO, the notorious Conor McGregor! Conor Notorious McGregor, winner by TKO.